A hundred years ago this month, Albert Einstein gave a series of four lectures, all at the Prussian Academy of Sciences in Berlin, culminating with his announcement of the discovery of the general theory of relativity, one lecture per week. Now, this week, in fact, 100 years ago today, on November 4th, 1915, Einstein gave his first lecture, and it was focused on this paper over here that he'd written a couple of years earlier with this fella, Marcel Grossman. And Einstein describes how he thought that this was the right approach to realizing the general theory of relativity, but he forthrightly describes how he now doesn't think so. He realized that he'd made a mistake in an earlier calculation and no longer believes that this is the way to go. So Einstein then describes to the members of the academy that he's going back to earlier geometrical ideas that he had been developing while he was in Zurich a couple years earlier that are in this famous notebook, Einstein's Zurich Notebook. And he describes how this is now going to be his focus. Einstein leaves the lecture and is pursuing these mathematical ideas with incredible intensity. In fact, he writes to his son that he's so engrossed in his work that he sometimes forgets to eat. Now, in the midst of that incredible focus, Einstein gets a shock, catches wind that this fellow over here, this is David Hilbert, a German mathematician, who Einstein had met with a few months earlier in June of 1915, and he told Hilbert all of his ideas toward the general theory of relativity, a nice, very friendly conversation. Einstein learns that Hilbert has found the flaws in the paper of Einstein and Grossman and is trying to figure out how to fix them and to push forward toward the general theory of relativity. So Einstein is really surprised, so he quickly writes to Hilbert and tells him, hey look, I've already found those errors, I know about those flaws, and I am pushing forward toward the final form of the theory. Einstein hopes that that will push Hilbert away, but it is a quite unnerving moment for Albert Einstein because for the first time in his long journey, he realizes that he's got stiff competition on this final leg of the race toward the general theory of relativity.